Hi everyone, I'm Asama and welcome to MedSketch. The toxin of the day is cocaine and for ease, we have named the scene as Snow Street. As you can see our street with a fresh snowfall. Name of the scene is also important because cocaine is also known as Snow Cadillac or White Lady or Coke. So let's start with the category of cocaine. You can see a doctor talking to a lady. The doctor has a bubble with the brain entangled in a chain and there is also an injection and a timer. So the brain is representing the class of the poison that is cerebral poison and the chains are representing the mode of action. So basically cocaine causes depression after stimulating the upper cerebral and medullary centers of the brain and it basically is involved in CNS depression and we have represented this with brain that is entangled with chains. Also, it causes an aesthetic effect that is represented by the injection and the timer. So let's talk about the fatal dose and fatal period of cocaine. For fatal period, you can see on the left side of scene, there is a pole, street pole with the vertical LED light that is showing the time of 2 o'clock, meaning the fatal period of cocaine is 2 hours. For fatal dose, you can see in the right bottom, there is a carton that is representing a label of 1 gram and 30 packs. So 1 gram is representing the fatal dose when it is ingested orally and 30 gram is the fatal dose when it is via mucosal contact. Just in front of the pole, you can see a guy in green shirt sitting on the ground and he is injecting something in his veins. And you can also see a powder in his front and some tablets are lying on the ground. So these are representing the mode of administration as cocaine can be ingested, injected and it can be sniffed as well. Let's talk about the signs and symptoms of acute poisoning of cocaine. So they are represented by two guys, one in the red shirt just beneath the pole and our LED light. And second stage is represented by a grey guy that is sitting just beside the trash cart. So basically there are two stages. First one is the euphoric stage and the second one is the depressive stage. So the euphoric stage is represented by a guy with bottles in his hand and he is in state of excitation, euphoria, delirium, convulsions. So these were the main features of the euphoric stage. Other non-important factors may be dry mouth, bitter taste, increased libido, excitement, delirium, flushed face, dilated pupils, blood vision, increased heart rate, increased respiration, raised temperature, vomiting, increased movements, lack of coordination, muscle twitches. But you can simply remember the state of euphoria and excitement. The depressive state is represented by a boy that is sitting just beside the trash cart and the color of the boy is grayish black representing a sad state of affairs and you can see an injection is lying beside. So the second stage is stage of depression. Vital centers are depressed. There is feeble pulse and death from respiratory and circulatory failure can occur in the depressive state. So let's talk about the chronic poisoning of cocaine, also known as cocaineism. So on the right side, you can see a boy in light red or pink shirt with blue jeans and he is scratching his arms. So basically, he is representing the magnon sign. This sign is very important and it is often asked in your exams. So magnon sign is characteristic of cocaineism. The patient feels if grains of sand are lying under the skin or small insects are creeping on the skin giving a sensation of formication. So it was the magnet sign. Also you can see in front of the boy there is an LGBT flag lying on the ground. The flag is representing the homosexuality that is often seen in cocaine addicts and there are also other sexual perversions as well. So let's go back to the start. You can see our doctor talking to a pregnant lady who is smoking something and in front of the baby you can see a doll. As you can see the head of the doll is cracked. So it is representing the crack baby syndrome. The use of cocaine by pregnant women particularly smoking produces babies with congenital malformations and growth restrictions called crack babies. Another phenomena associated with cocaine 
is the body packer syndrome you can see on the left upper corner there is a board saying body packing is prohibited representing the body packer syndrome this happens to people who smuggle cocaine into their bodies by putting in plastic bags and then swallowing it or injecting it in the git the packets might rupture or break spilling a significant amount of cocaine that could be lethal so you might have seen the discovery channel or the national geographic channel representing stories of people who smuggle cocaine so basically it's the phenomena of body packing so let's talk about the medical legal aspects of cocaine as you can see on the left side there is a woman with a cross so basically it is used by prostitutes locally and they inject a solution of cocaine into the vagina with a douche cap and by doing so it gives them a sensation of local constriction in the sky you can see our hero superman that is stopping a meteor by his hands so our hero is representing heroin and he is stopping a speed ball so basically this is representing the formation of speed ball that is utilized commonly and it is made by the combination of cocaine and heroin so heroin plus cocaine is equal to speed ball in the right corner just beside the box you can see our classy lady she is holding a glass of liquid wine so it is representing the formation of liquid lady that is a mixture that is formed by mixing ethanol with cocaine just above the lady's head you can see a name of cocktail that is known as mac cocktail in our video it is representing brompton cocktail mac cocktail for the ease of remembering its composition so let's remember the ingredients of the cocktail it is very easy from the name morphine alcohol cocaine chlorpromazine and it was used previously to alleviate severe pain in terminal cancer patients so let's talk about the treatment of cocaine poisoning so in front of the trash bin you can see our decontamination lady from organophosphorus video so if applied locally to the nose or throat it can be removed by washing with warm water or normal saline so decontamination is the first step also you can see our classic gastric lavage bottle with the label of KMNO4 so if the drug is swallowed stomach should be washed with the dilute solution of KMNO4 in case of body packers catharsis or whole bowel irrigation may help in flushing the packages out of the intestine or in surgical er's removal of the packets can also be done so let's talk about the drug therapy in case of cocaine poisoning just above the board of body packing you can see a barbie that is representing barbiturates so barbiturates or diazepam can be used to control the excitement or the euphoric state caused by the cocaine the rest of the treatment is symptomatic so let's wrap up the treatment you can do decontamination you can do a gastric lavage with kmno4 in case of body packers you can do bowel irrigation or surgical removal and excitement is controlled by barbiturates or diazepam an important point that i missed during the video was perforated nasal septum just above the kmno4 gastric lavage bottle you can see a gray pipe with holes on it whenever the cocaine is sniffed via the nasal route it causes perforation of the nasal septum represented by holes in the pipe so here was our video of cocaine if you have any questions or queries feel free to ask in the comment section till then take care Detail literature of toxins, refer, our textbook, Excel Forensic Medicine and Toxicology available at all major medical bookstore all over Pakistan.